this VC glitch helped me gain 100,000 VC in just 24 hours. Yo, what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Nihon coming to you on another banger video. Today, I'm showing you guys the two best VC glitches. I'm showing you variation one right now, the best one, and variation two, the fun way. And I recommend doing the boring way. It gets you more VC, but I know a lot of people are going to start complaining. Oh, the fun way gave me less VC. Shut up, and I told you. So, <laughs> so let's get on to method number one. So, we made it into the play now section, and you want to go to Blacktop. I'm sure everyone knows about this glitch, but it's the better version of this glitch you want to click you can click on anything it depends if you're starting a border 1v1 2v2 3v3 4v4 or 5v5 i would personally be going with the 1v1 and for the side you can go bringers or ballers it does not really matter but you want to user create your roster and pick whatever says the vc glitch on it uh it just ends up being this one it might be different on playstation but you should want to click on that and it should take you right here you just want to pick bringers or ballers it does not matter and you want to hit advance game conditions put it to five it, it, it's just so much faster you could also put it to six if you're kind of lazy but five is just the best like you you can't go wrong with five but for this uh i in this i should have gone with joel Embiid and ben simmons here but i just end up choosing my my player just because i'm most comfortable with him so i'm clicking y three times and picked mr goat df and i'm picking 40 year overall ben simmons i don't know to get the rosters right <laughs> but once we're loading into this it should show the 2k tv answers but i'm talking about the 2k tv answers i dropped a full video on the 2k tv answers the link will be in the description down below so make sure you guys watch the video the whole total watching all the 2k tv episodes gives you 140,000 vc also all right so we finished loading into the black top thing and all you want to do is click your three lines button or your menu button and you want to go down until you see it should be in options and settings you want to change it to superstar uh go down from superstar you want to go to rookie it's the easiest you can also mess with the sliders but that defeats the vc somewhat a little bit and once they start off with the ball you just want to let them take a layup boom ben simmons took his layup and you should get the ball you should be spamming a or x around here depends what button mapping you're on and you just want to shoot it boom you got two points on the board you got to do that three more times so i was saying six game conditions aren't that bad so all you want to do is just go through this so going through this will give you about a lot per shot also but it's not based off of like shot per vc it's based off how quick you get the games done so if you get the game done and you'll get you'll get 500 vc get the game done 500 vc get the game done 500 vc it's just like that hit another two pointer it's only twos and ones it's like street court basketball some people don't know about this mode actually it's a bit kind of old to 2k but a lot of people still don't really play this that much because it's the offline mode. he just missed the layup come on all right so this can be the last shot you will be shooting and three two one and do a fade well bam and you just hit the fade away from the mid range and look at the pop up right here look at the pop up right here boom your vc earnings have been saved to 2k sports center so you you do not want to click rematch a lot of these videos say click rematch and you'll get another 500,000 vc you want to click quit you know your rematch vc does not stack up so you just want to quit and then once you're back into the like play now screen you just want to go to blacktop again and replay and go through those steps again so you just want to keep doing that until you have a comfortable amount of vc that you are fine with so again you want to click 1v1 ringers change the game rosters so let's get on to version number two want to know how i got dripped out like that i hit the subscribe button you know why none of you guys have that because this little people amount of you guys are actually subscribed to the channel make sure you subscribe so this is the fun version and the version a lot of you guys are probably not gonna be doing because it gives you less vc but is a whole lot way more fun to do and highly recommend this if you're starting to get bored or you just want to have some fun and you're just alone or you can play with friends if you just want to do the offline version so you want to go back to the play now and um yeah that's all you want to do you just want to go there and hit that subscribe button too because we're on the road to 3,000 subscribers before 2k23 comes out so you just want to go play now online so oh that record 11 and 20 and a 35 win percentage my record on this is horrific it is so bad but you can pick whatever tier you would like this is the teams in tier one so while it's loading you want to kick 
click team control and bucks bulls clippers heat jazz lakers nets nuggets suns warriors and yeah those are just all the teams so you can pick whatever team is your favorite but there's also two other tiers that i actually re recommend checking out and a lot of people would actually c like want you to check out because those teams might have your favorite teams so you just want to leave that and click on a tier with two and tier two has a couple different teams it's more of the really good teams so yeah you want to go to back to team control celtics Grizzlies, Mavericks, Nets, Pacers, Thunder, Spurs, Suns, and for tier number three, you want to go with, uh, while it's loading, tier number three has some better teams, uh, just all like top tier teams, this is before the season started, so the teams might not be as great, it, oh, these are the worst teams, Hawks, Pelicans, Kings, Knicks, Magic, Pistons, Rockets, Hornets, Wizards, Cavs. Like, these teams are bad. So once you pick your team, you just want to ready up into an online match. And once you're in the online match, you just want to start playing. And a lot of times, if you're up by a good lead, people will quit. And that would just give you VC very quickly. Or people just try quitting off the start. If people try quitting off the start, you will get VC off the banging of a way. And I highly do recommend, if you're really good at the game or you just want to have fun, just play online online is so fun even if you lose it's so competitive and fun just to play against people who are just sweats at online and you just can play against them and just have some fun while earning a good amount of vc so yeah i highly do recommend playing online especially if you're starting to get bored of getting vc or you're just tired out of just getting vc and just same repeating that over in blacktop i really highly recommend doing this especially especially if you need some vc and you want it for fun ways so let's come to the outro thanks for watching today's banger video hopefully you guys enjoyed it because if you did enjoy it, please hit the subscribe button we're again we're on the road to 3,000 subscribers before nba 2k23 comes out if we hit 3,000 subscribers i will literally do anything as the top comment says on every single video between this video and 3,000 subscribers so hit the subscribe button and comment something wild and crazy for me to do because if you watched up till this point you are a real OG and just comment down the go emoji for a heart and a subscribe back because that's how I know if you're the realest one of them all but thanks for watching today's video and hope you guys watch some more of me again hit that subscribe button and if you did again enjoy these type of videos hit the like button so I know to make more VC glitches so I'm out y'all <laughs> I got what you want